What are you really hoping to find out? Oh no, I just realized the O is back. Stop. So what are you really hoping to find about Ratman here? Who is he first of all? And why does he do all this superhero stuff? That's a point, Shirley. Nobody knows. It's all a big mystery. He only ever appears wearing his trademark Ratman suit. So nobody can tell who he really is. Why a rat? It's bad enough having to be a dog. You'd think he'd want recognition for all the good deeds he does. Perhaps he's just extremely self-conscious? Wouldn't you be more self-conscious riding up in an outfit like that? How rude to that. Well, anyway, seeing as we don't know anything about him, I suppose we should start, start by asking around if anybody's actually seen him. It sounds like he's making fairly regular appearances until recent. So we stand a good chance of finding someone who's seen him. Very good, Miss Layton. I'll ask some passerby. First... Dio. Thank you. My god, I got some noise fast. I have a feeling it's gonna be with her. Mind you, I think I have to talk to... Let's talk to you first. I'm just walking the beat one more time before heading back to the yard. Yeah, no, so it's... Miss Rilton and this guy here, which name I already forgot. Oh, Granny Rilton. Oh, dear me. You are busy bodies, aren't you? Now, what are you up to today? Another case, is it? The old gossip. Her curiosity could cure her. Her curi curiosity could kill her. Eh, hey, cat? Haha. <laughs> You're actually investigating Ratman at the moment. Dear me. Whatever next. Ratman, you say? I don't suppose you know his true identity by any chance. Sure she does, Cat. She probably knows how to make perpetual motion work too. Oh, I'm sorry, my dear. I won't know what I've been reading the papers. I see. But it's not like you're a fan anyway. Oh well, it's hard not to be. I mean, it's such a juicy story, isn't it? So I must know who the mysterious here is. I always made a point of reading the special features they do on him all the time. Oh, I didn't realize we were a times reader, Mr. Riddleton. Oh, dear me, yes, I read a lot of papers. I'll have you know, young man. But I, enjoy, but I do enjoy the London Times especially. After lots of juicy tidbits, always lots of ju juicy tidbits in there. Celebrity romance, strange creature sightings. Oh, it's what keeps me going. Yes, I quite understand. There was a magazine by the same publisher that had a feature on Ratman as well. I snapped it up, I tell you. Well, I do hope they keep coming up with all these delightful stories. <laughs> so yeah, we're probably also gonna have to talk to the magazine publisher. I have a feeling anyway. Ah, good evening again, Douglas. Oh, gather information for a story, are you? Hello again, as it happens. I finished my interviews now and I'm just on my way back to the office. I, st I just realized his name is Douglas Dirt, like, he's supposed to dig dirt on people? Like, gossiping and the like? <clears throat> Did you find the boss? Have a good gander at the paper stern of all the column office, didn't you? Yes, we spoke to Mr. Lloyd. He asked us to investigate the current whereabouts of Ratman. Oh, so that's his game, is it? You know, it was your school in Charlie Ratman's story when, when he was well still about. So, you mean you've met him then? You've met Ratman? Of course I have, dozens of times. Although that being said, he's an elusive fella who zips away as soon as he's done his work, so a medium takes some doing. Wow, dozens of times? That's simply spiffy. <laughs> I can't tell you the right stories about something I haven't seen, can I? So whenever Redman... Sorry, hold on. Cat friend went to my ear. In my ear, no, into my eye. So whenever Redman shows his, sta his tail, all Doug, Doug is on the capture the tail. Gosh, you're just like a superhero too, Mr. Doug. A rhyming one. Haha, <laughs> not me, lad. I'm just the one who gets it out there to the public. Except, of course, that Ratman no longer seems to be around. Except that indeed, miss. London without rats just ain't London. Not sure how to feel about that, honestly. Of course, we've conducted our investigation to the disappearance of our little friend, 
but it turned up nothing. Till this squad. Yes, because he's so elusive, such a mysterious, such a mysterious crusader. But have no fear. The people of Alon's voices won't fall on their fears. The rat will be back. Mm. An elusive hero making unexpected appearances. We don't seem to have found out much of any... Uh, much of any use about Ratman, do you? Do we? I think I read that completely wrong. No, it's hard when you... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. No, it's hard when you're trying to find out about someone who does their utmost to remain a mystery. I thought cats were, uh, were expert at, at catching rodents. Very amusing, show. I think perhaps we need to bro broaden our area. Let's interview some pe people further afield. I will place my pet dog with a more useful cat as a last resort. Jesus, you're really traveling far. Oh, no wonder I felt no wonder I look familiar. It's the yes, the guild hall. No wonder because I could have sort of looked familiar to me in the map, but I wasn't quite sure why. Gosh, there's still a lot of people around guild hall this time, aren't there? It's all about the office workers heading home after the day's work, I think, honestly. Let's as many people as we can if they know anything about rat. Poponio, the Poponio guy, the coast guy, the... I think his name is Miss... Hesitate, right? Or something like that. Yeah, this is just more... text. Yeah, apparently there are new locations for for hint coins, cause I'm positive this year isn't, didn't used to be a hint coin one. Wait, okay. yeah, more stuff to talk about. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, I think that's all there is here. Oh, yeah, I remember this one here used to be a one of the where they used to talk about what it was, but now there's it for you. Okay. I think I have a puzzle, because you tend to have puzzles for me. Yep. Hello, I have a brand new puzzle just for you, fresh today. A puzzle? Wonderful. Huh. Why is it so easy to do business with puzzles, but so hard with poponios? Oh well, the wishes of the customers come first. Here's your puzzle! I kind of feel sorry for him sometimes. A question of sport. There are pictures stuck up that represent success and failure in two different sports. The pictures, a picture on the left shows success, and the picture on the right shows failure. Each of the sports are viewed from the side in the same location. Which picture at the top represents football, but which sport is represented by the picture at the bottom? Oh, sorry, the picture at the top represents football, but... <clears throat> Wait... I think I know what it is. I have... Because... It's a four-letter word. It's supposed to be a sport. And... Uh... One of the stereotypes in Britain is that everyone loves golf. And that in tennis, I don't know why. <coughs> Sorry, something stuck in my throat. And I think this is the second or third golf puzzle, golf or puzzle with the answer that is a golf, I think. This is an interesting one. Puzzles are made for solving. You did it! Hole in one, when you're successful at golf, the ball is in the hole. Well, that was a really fun puzzle, thank you. I hope you'll offer us more, more of them in the future. I want to offer Poponios, really, not puzzles. But, 
Okay. I'll settle him. Excuse me, Hessie. Sorry to bother you, but have you heard of Ratman? Oh, um, Ratman? Uh, yes, I have. I think. Yes, I read about about him in the um, paper. Ah, I see. So you don't know much else about him, then? No, not really. Obviously, as a public servant, I uh, I want to learn from an example. Um, I mean, you know, helping the people of um, London. You mean you're not? You're the sort of person who's quick to step in and lend a hand when a member of the public is in trouble? Oh, well, um, no. I mean, I was thinking I should start, um... <laughs> just start bodybuilding. Body... <laughs> bodybuilding. I, um... It's not a question of physical strength. You're perfectly... Perfectly capable of helping people as you are, I'm sure. Um, I don't know. If you don't have strength, you are you need speed. Well, okay. The bodybuilding part really got me by surprise. Excuse me, sir. I was wondering if you could help us. Have you ever seen Ratman? If by seeing you mean being helped by open bracket. Now that I'm boasting, close bracket, then yes. Why? You mean Ratman actually appeared to rescue once? Bingo! Tell us all about it, please. Uh, well, I was... it was about three months ago now, I think. I'd gone down to Bowling Hill. Hey, Nix, I was wondering when you were gonna join me. There's a little cinema down there where they... I think I'm hitting the mic with Nix by scratching your back. There, uh, okay, just lay there. Stay as far away from the keyboard as, as possible, please. There. There's a little cinema down, the, down there where they were showing an old Maverick Rector film I wanted to see. Open bracket. That is not one of his best. Close bracket. Yeah, this guy is a Maverick Director's fan, I remember that. Samira showed up and tried to get me to give them money. Golly, what did you do? I said no, of course. But they were real toads. They started to gra to they started to get rough and then da na na da na 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 da na 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 Batman appeared. Okay, that is obviously a reference to the na 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 Batman. New song that exists. It has to be. And you saw them off for you? Yep. You gave them a taste of their own medicine. Which gave me time to run away. Oh, so you don't know what happened after that then? With Ratman. No, I I legged it out of there as fast as I could. I suppose I should have said thank you, really. Oh well. So that was in Bowling Hill, you say? That's right, that's what I said. Apparently he pops up there a lot. Yes, yeah, I've heard that Bully Hill isn't the nicest part of town. Lots of petty crime there, they say. Yep, I'm not going anywhere near the place ever again. If you end up going there, you want to be very careful. Thank you for the warning. And the very helpful information. So Ratman often appears in Bully Hill, does he? I'm pretty sure I'm saying the name of that place wrong, but whatever. Yes, that's useful to know. There could have been, there could be very well be other people who've met him. Let's head that way now and see what we can find out. Really, that's not a clue. Huh. Odd, but okay. On the move. Ah, yes. A bowling, yeah, I see it's a bowling green. Nix just. Just lay down. If you want to lay on my lap, it's okay. I don't mind. Uh, just a second. Don't. There. There. Now Nix is laying on my lap. Hopefully that'll make her relax. Well, this is Bowling Green, Miss Layton. This park is a sort of Bowling Hill district. Yeah, and they have for some reason the depiction of... I think I think it's supposed to be Atlas who holds the sky 
outer world. Yeah, but uh, the original one is that it's supposed to hold the sky from falling down. Hmm. Apart from the statue, which is impressive, there's not much here, is there? It's not much of a park. Sorry, I have to adjust the mic so I don't keep bumping the things. It used to be a thriving industrial quarter, miss. But now it's rather gone to the dogs. There's a lot of unsavory rumors about the place, I'm afraid. About gangs and miscreants. We should be careful. Cat? Yes, Cheryl? I get the feeling we're being watched. Watched? By who? Oh no. We haven't been the target already, have we? Run, Miss Slayton, quickly! Hey, you! Ah, oh, this is interesting. Ah, oh, leave us alone. Oh. Ah, uh, okay, he's a, he's a rat when he's robbing. You're a Catrell, right? A detective? Um, I'm Catrell, yes. Can I help you? It's just a little boy. I was told to give you this. Is that a little rat costume he's in? Oh, a note. What's all this about him? If you keep pursuing this case, you'll disappear just like Ratman did. Well... Is that just some being? Is that just someone being a wag, or is that a bona fide threat? Things are starting to get interesting, boys. Weirdo. <laughs> I cannot agree with you. Tell me, what did the person who asked you to give me this look like? Um, he had glasses and he was skinny, and he had a head like a balloon. So it's Caesar. Mm, head like a balloon. I feel like I met someone like that recently. Do you know where he is now? No, after he gave me that note, he disappeared. Okay, why the heck was he wearing this guys? Like putting a... Uh, make himself look big or different, I... Whatever. It sounds like he's seen off right now. Now he's starting to see you off too, miss. That's certainly the way it seems from this note, yes. Which means the power mouse of justice has a mortal enemy. Very likely. After all, Batman has, has been putting a stop to criminal activity, so he's bound to have upset a few people. But what do we do now, then? When you find fight to, to uphold the law, you expect a little opposition. I'm not about to let a little threat like that put me off. In fact, this may be more determined than ever. Bravo, Miss Layton. That's the spirit. Wait, I just realized something. If Caesar is supposed to be Ratman, because again, I'm almost positive as him, and Catrell is a detective who, you know, is actually willing to do the right stuff and how the citizen isn't corrupt and all that. No, wait. Inspector Hastings would be the equivalent of the Commissioner Gordon. But who the hell would she be? Bad girl, maybe? Mm. So, first things first. Let's explore the area thoroughly. Maybe we can find this balloon head who decided to threaten me and pop him. Well, that's macabre as all hell. Oh. Light! Red Bunny Razor. <laughs> okay, I can actually see that I can be... Because I think there were... When... Batman was... I can even today you can still find Batman... Nick, don't! You can still find Batman power enough for... Batman stuff. I'm never gonna be able to say that word. I can already tell. Sorry, I'm, I'm having to keep an eye on Licks, Nicks, and she's also getting in the way of my screen, so I kind of can have to see. Oh, there's a puzzle. Do you live near, near here? Yeah, just over there. I come to the park all the time. I love your outfit. Do you like superheroes? Superheroes are the greatest. They're not scared of anyone. That's right. 
They're splendid, aren't they? You like superheroes too? My favorite is Stratford. He's the best. He's stronger than anyone. I bet he could even beat this thing. Puzzle 87 Core War. I have a feeling that's supposed to be a problem Cold War, isn't it? Uh, sorry. Uh, there's a bunch of nicks here on my face now. The big bad block monster has appeared. You can defeat the monster by destroying all the blocks, but, it, but attacking blocks that are not core blocks does nothing. Select a core block, a block with a shiny red orb, will destroy both that block and the blocks around it if they have arrows pointing their way. Destroy all the blocks and tell those poor chicks free. What? Like... So there's, there's Ratman there in the in the photo here. Kind of cute. Um. So in conclusion, that's a relief. I wasn't entirely sure. How was that a puzzle? You literally just click on the box that have red cores and then you win. Yeah, you did a nice fight, Ratman. The chicks, the chicks have safely returned to their parents, and Ratman secretly defended the city from harm. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just saw for some reason I have a lot of Nix's hair in my face. Hold on. And I'm not even sure why, I haven't even, I always scratch her. There, good defeats evil once again. Oh, that was amazing, you're like a superhero too. I, I don't think Ratman actually fights most of them, does he? So, he could. And that, my friend, is how you can actually make a lot more money of Ratman. You owe a stupid amount of publishing media, don't you? And make one for comics, make comics of Ratman. He's gonna sell like hotcakes. And you could even make new heroes. Like Uberman or something like that. I, you know, it's supposed to be a part of Superman. And apparently, there is an Ultraman that's an evil Superman on DC, so. Go figure. And I bet he'd win if he did too. You saw I can write me as number one fan. I am. No one likes Ratman more than me. And none even got me the school suit. I bet, you even, I bet you don't even have a Ratman. No. So have you ever seen Ratman then? Or been helped by him even? Don't be silly. Ratman only comes out at night. I'm always in bed. Good for you. Anyway, I have to go now or mom will get angry. Still feel like someone's watching us. Look, that chap's staring just at us. I, I don't like the look of him. Ah, good. Let's go and ask him some questions. I I don't think that's a good idea, Miss Layton. It could be dangerous. You won't get any information you need if you let Sophia see them that way, Ernest. Come along. Catch your a... Uh, how shall I say... Fierce and reckless genius of an idiot. Let's see what you have to tell me. Hey, 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 what are you doing this run down shadowy shadow of former glory? We're investigating the so-called paramount of justice, Ratman. Have you ever met him? Never, sorry, never. Heard the name, but that's all. Oh, pity. Now let me ask you a question. Do you know about the Bolin Man? Enshrined in metal forever, a relic of the past? The Bolin Man? In the statue? Of course! Many a long years has the bone man watched over the green hill. Watches fort watch fortress come and go. 
Of course, he wasn't always called that. But over time, because of the space here in the Bowling Green, people gave him that name. The, th the thing that bothers me about him is his size. Isn't, isn't he a little too grand for this park? A son of the times, you see. Days gone by, this whole area was grand. Now all that remains is a statue in people's memories. I see. It was built at a time when... Sorry, it was built at a time when this era's fortune was a little different. Well, that explains it. It's rather sad, sad that, isn't it? Yeah, again, this guy is obviously based on Atlas. Again, I'm, I think I'm talking about the right guy. No, I just realized there's a deer in Africa. Africa, Madagascar, you can see Brazil. Shout out Brazil where I'm from. You can also see some, other, some parts of India and Iran. I think that, I think this here is London, right? And here's the Asian... Is Asia? I don't think you can see Russia, do I? I can probably see a bit of... No, wait. I think I can see a bit of... China and Greece, I don't know. And no, I don't think you can see Australia here. He's running away! Hmm, suspicious. He seems to be deliberately avoiding us. Should we try to call him, Cat? Of course. I've got to ask him why he ran away from us. Get enough down the street there. Alright then, after him! Come on, you two! Yeah, this is a new part of town. 